I hope you all had a wonderful uh, time over the holidays, you know, as much as we can. So I figure I'll do uh, some unboxings. Uh, so here you can see it is again from Diamond Art Club and it is a square. We have Willow. She's so cute. <laughs> She's a square drill. She's 42 by 59. And uh, the artist is Hannah Lynn. I actually have quite a few of her work. I quite enjoy her stuff. So I open that. I don't know why I'm taking it off the screen, but still. Here we have a sticker sheet with all the information. I do think she looks really pretty. We've got 40 colours. Let's see. One, two, three ABs. So we'll go and find those in a bit. Because this is a square, we've got the standard tool kit with tweezers. If it was a round kit, then there would be no tweezers. That's literally the only difference. You always get a clear boat, a squidgy, a pen, plates, wax, and some baggies. This is for your book, journal, or box, whatever you want to do. Because some people obviously can't just stand them up like that. So when you've got them all stored away, you can pop it on your sides. Anywhere that's helpful for you. Personally, I just collect these at the moment. So let's have a look, see, shall we? You always get one of these step-by-step -step instructions in case you're giving it to someone. Let you know. And on this side here, you've usually got a uh, code, a little thank you code. Hey, just a little bag of drills. Not a big one. So it's only a forty-two by fifty-nine. But nice small kits do nice and easy. Right, let's flip this the other way around. This is poured glue, so you can. Uh, Always kind of get away with that. Down here you've got all their media info. Let's have a look see. Whee! There she is, let's see. Her. There we go. So yeah, look at her. All covered in nature, flowers. I'm loving the eyes, they're really unusual. Little ears at the top there. So as you can see we've got a legend down here and a legend over here top as well we've got the schematic so an image of uh, what it looks like and all the information up here as well I think the only info that's not up here is that it's by Hannah Lynn but this is an older kit I believe while I'm up here let's have a look at the drill field as you can see nice clear and easy to read plus they don't often have unusual you know that much of an unusual symbol it's usually uh, alphabet numbers, uh, things you can find on the keyboard. So yeah, nice, clear, and easy to read. Let's flip her over. Looks so classy like that. Bring that down and get ready to do the drills. Oh, forgot to mention they always have a sticker so you can match it up. In case you store your sand before you build separate. Right, let's have a look see. Right, let's start off with this little bag here. Three ten. One, two, three, four, five, six bags of three ten. Let's have a look at the back of them. See how they're looking. If we can focus. Hard to see, but this camera is better than my last one. Little round bit there, but otherwise okay. Let's pop that over there. Make sure I've got it the right way up. Oh. What am I doing? I don't know. Yeah, my bad. Right, here we go. So we've got nine oh four. 8, 9, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8
means they're an or Aurora Borealis, I get the words out. Aurora Borealis drill. <laughs> it's a special coating. It just makes it shimmer and shine like the uh, northern lights or like a rainbow. Sometimes it comes out better on others, but in natural, in person, it is pretty, pretty nice. We've got one, three, six, well, two ABs right next to each other. Sweet. So this is a lovely blue. It's coming off a bit more purple. Oh no, it is a purpley sort of blue. It's one of those funny ones. Blur of four or something, I don't know. Another mystery round while I'm trying to get into this kit. Wait, that's two of them. There we go. 907. 938. Lost my words today. 3371. 3818. 603. 890. 700. That's quite a cool thing. Well, it's coming up brighter on my camera. It's quite dark green. That's strange. Wonder. Wonder if there's a way to get a more true. That's a bit more. True, I don't know. Nine twenty-eight. Uh, seven fifty-eight. Again, it's kind of quite orangey, but it's more of a peachy. What did I say? Seven fifty-eight. Seven fifty-four. Two of those. Double trouble. And six nine-nine. Yeah, looking at that. Colours are a little off on my camera than they are in person. But at least we're focused. Whee! Right, let's have a look. Now the little baggie's got 301, 155, 356, sorry, I couldn't quite do that, 443, 647, 666, uh, 333s. 912, 913, 308, that's 208, I'll probably 718, can't quite pick it up on the camera but the odd twinkle and 38.46 I think these are the same shade but I don't know if you can see how one this one has got an extra twinkle almost like an extra twinkle in its eye the slightly, this one's slightly lighter sorry not the same shade my bad right let's put this all back together there we go, so they're all back in the bag. So let's have a looky at our wee, little sticker sheet. Sticker sheet. So our first AB drill, 134, you're going to focus, there we go, is number 1. We've got V and number 7. So 1, V and 7. This might confuse some people. Um, honestly, it really doesn't bother me. But you, typically, certainly on all their newer kits, um, the AB drills are at the front, so they're usually one, one, two, and three, so on and so forth. Um, but some of the older kits, they're kind of mid, either at the start or at the bottom. Honestly, it does above me. Once they're in their containers, I have them labelled up in a uh, symbol, number, alphabet order. Never use one, two, three, four. Just don't do it. Um, but that's just me personally. All right, so one, V, and seven. Let's have a look. See. So we've got, let's have a look, see. So we've got a bit of V up here and up here as well. So it's in her hair. So let's get her throughout her hair. In her eyes, we've got some seven. Some more seven. And also, again, number one is also over here. So it seems to be scattered throughout. Her sort of vines. I don't know if they're vines or tattoos of vines. They seem to be pretty well, pretty well sprinkled about. So yeah. So yeah, let me know what you think of Willow. I think she looks pretty, pretty sweet to be honest. Lots and lots of fun colours. So I hope to speak to you next time. Stay safe and thanks for watching. Bye.